Welcome to Todd's Two Minute Tech Tip Tuesday, brought to you by Big Beard Battery. Visit BigBeardBattery.com. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button, that way you don't miss anything. Hey, Todd here with Big Beard Battery, and I want to talk about completely automating your solar system on your RV. So, one of the issues that we see with a lot of first time solar uh, system operators is understanding roughly how much power they have and actually how to manage it. Now, there may be an onboard generator, but you still have to be alerted when to start the generator, when to turn it off. Well, what if you can automate that by putting on just a GSCM, which is just a generator start control module. You can program that through the Vitron system to go ahead and start the generator whenever you reach a certain level of state of charge. Now, for us, we typically set it up. We love to have our solar do all the work, but I want to be topped off at night so that way my batteries can take care of everything. So I want to make sure maybe around nine o'clock at night that I'm, I'm running into nighttime with 100% of my batteries. Well, normally I'd have to go up and start my generator, kind of run it for a while and then turn it off whenever we're done. I can automate and program this thing to start at a specific time or at a uh, specific state of charge. So if I said 70%, turn it off at 90%, maybe 95%. So that way I can kind of edge into the night. So a generator start control module will help the automation process. It works you know, with the Vitron system or any other system. It connects directly to uh, the pigtail of your generator, right? And there's various types of generators out there. With the Vitron system, if you have a Servo GX, you can actually control everything at your touch screen should you have a touch. So you can manual start from the screen of your Vitron system if you wanted, but also set up the automation. So if that's something you're interested in, uh, the one the brand that we actually typically use is the Atkinson uh, Generator Start Control Module. If you're wondering why you need a Generator Start Control Module, it's simply because the Vitron system, basically the relays are open and closed relay. And you need something to press and hold your generator. You notice that whenever you start your generator, you have to press and hold it typically when you're using the Gen Start. So, this right here helps with that automation to go ahead and press and hold for say 15, 20 seconds, get the generator started, okay? All the logic is already uh, located inside your servo, but here we have an external relay to help finish the automation. Some people will say, well, what about quiet hours? <laughs> well, they already have set up to where you don't run the generator during quiet hours or run it for a short period of time. You run it for 30 minutes, by the time someone finds out your generator's on, it's already off. There's your tech tip. Hey, if you got questions about batteries or want to go ahead and put in a solar system, but need some guidance, head over to bigbeardbattery.com, fill out the solar design form, and one of our certified solar experts will give you a call and get you started.